So guys, welcome back to my game music reaction channel. And uh, I just saw the Grammy nominations list. And uh, firstly, the weekend was snubbed massively, which is kind of crazy. But secondly, uh, I saw Katie, uh, Katie, Taylor Swift. So I used to saying Katy Perry. Taylor Swift, uh, her album got nominated for Grammys and best songs and stuff. And you know, I'm, I mean, I've always kind of liked her music, but I just haven't listened. I didn't even know she dropped an album. I haven't listened to one song from that new album. So I'm going to react to Cardigan because it seems like the biggest song of her last album. One with two million likes on YouTube, so obviously a popular song. Um, but yeah, I wouldn't mind doing some Taylor Swift reactions. I've always been a fan of hers. Yeah, why not? Why not? Why not? Anyway, let's uh, let's get into the music. Vintage tea, brand new phone, high heels on, cobblestones. When you are young, they assume you know nothing. Poof. Way to start a song, man. Jeez, way to start a song. First 20 seconds and you're like, that's it. <laughs> you're like, that's it. You, whatever you've done, that's it. You got, you got it. Sequin smile, black lipstick, sensual. Taylor Swift videos are great. I remember her Look What You Made Me Do video, which was insane. Like, her, her music videos are always really fun to watch, to be fair. And I, I am watching the music videos all on the side here. But I'm listening to music mainly, to be honest. Friend to always a friend to none. It's not wrong. It's not wrong. You can't be there for everyone. You, you should, you know, have close friends. You can. They say you can put your close friends on one hand and be there for those friends instead of being nice, you know, friends to everyone. But you know, you're not gonna, you're not gonna ever be there for everyone. That's that's a good. That's a great line. Man. They assume you know nothing. Fantastic, man. Jeez, what am I doing? I haven't listened to this yet. Jeez, what am I doing? I, I don't know how I haven't listened to a new album yet. I mean, it's, it's, it sounds fantastic. An old cardigan under someone's bed. You put me on and said I was your That's such a good metaphor, the piano is like her, saved her. Yeah, I bet that she felt like that. She felt in the dark place and she can write music on the piano and it sort of saved her. Yeah, I, I picked that shit up. <laughs>
That's quite a nice garden to be fair. I need to get one of those. I'm wearing black right now, but you know. <laughs> Hell yeah. Taylor Swift, Cardigan. Great. I'll, you know, suggest if you guys enjoy the video, suggest other songs down below. Taylor Swift, maybe the rest of her new album or uh, other songs she done or other pop artists you want. Because yeah, I enjoyed this is the last reaction in my session. So I don't know when I release these. Um, I don't know. Probably these are quite late because that meaning um, if this does well, I can do some other Taylor Swift reactions. But yeah. This has been great, great song. I mean, she, she, Katy Perry is, you know, re Katy Perry, Taylor Swift, fucking hell. That's why I get for doing these Katy Perry reactions, man. <laughs> um, I'm tired now. I'm tired. It's the last, last one for my little mini reaction session. But, yeah, Taylor Swift is one of the biggest musicians of this generation for a reason. And she's a great songwriter and she's got a great voice. And she's she seems like a cool person, at least. And uh, she seems like, you know, she had that big, you know, at 1989, she was the biggest artist in the world. And then she kind of... You know, I don't say fell off because you 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 never sustain that. She, you know, she then had the second album which didn't do as well, obviously because it never was going to do that well. And now she seems like she's just in a place of like, you know, well, I'm famous enough where I can do music for a living. I don't need to be number one. I can just make the music I want, and it's great. You can tell she doesn't have to make some pop dance tune that will be big in the club if she doesn't want to. She can make a soft acoustic ballady album that you know really expresses what she feels. You, you can tell that through the music. You can tell that through the music. It's pretty pretty apparent. Um, I'd love to listen to the rest of her album. I'd love to. So, yeah. Comment down below other reactions for me to do. And uh, see you later, guys.